Hello, everyone, and welcome to my CHN podcast, Health Conversations Without Barriers. All right, so thank you for joining us for day four of Patient Appreciation Day. As we know, if you don't have patients, you really cannot have a health center, do you? So, Miriam, could you tell the listeners how we, how our patients appreciate us? The way that our patients appreciate us, they always give us really good surveys. I actually, in, in reality, let, let's talk about my my role with CHN. I am an outreach coordinator, so I'm out. I'm out and about in the community. I see patients. I see the community. I talk to them. And I think one of the most satisfying things that I've had experience, I have experienced, has been those families that have been in need and we were able to meet those needs, right? So I can tell you countless stories of families saying, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. I was needing X, Y, and Z, and you were able to do it for me. You were able to get that, meet those needs at a timely manner. And it's just nice to see. So I had um, actually at one of our events that we had, I had a family member come up to me and say, Miriam, I just want to say thank you from the bottom of my heart. My family and I are super grateful to have a health center like yours in our community. Um, my brother was um had suicidal thoughts. We were unable to have, we were unsuccessful at different um, behavior health clinics. And you guys were able to see him within the day. You were able to talk to him. You were, you were able to get him the care that he needed. Um, that to me is amazing. That to me shows how much they appreciate what we do. So, and let me go back to that. So, uh, these these are the people in need of quality healthcare, right? But sometimes they sacrifice healthcare more than uh, prevalent necessities. My CHN understands that the community members put food on their tables, pay their bills, and care for their families before paying for any healthcare services. Um, this leaves a high number of families and individuals without any affordable access to care. We want to give them the opportunity to do all of this while being healthy. So that became our purpose and drive: affordability, accessibility. And quality became our focus for the communities that we serve. Um, and as appreciation of my CHN, because again, Mariela, you did say it, they're the reason why we're here, right? If we wouldn't have our patients, we wouldn't be as successful as we are um, and care for them as much as we do. Um, so for National Health Center Week, what we're doing at each clinic, because we are trying to maintain their healthiness, um, we're having a table set up at each of our locations. We're going to provide fruit, water, and granola bars for our patients to just come in and see our table, learn a little bit more about our health centers, where we started, where we are at now, and learn a little bit more about National Health Center Week. So you will see this if you're a patient of ours. I highly uh, encourage you to come by our clinics, um, get yourself a snack, and really read a little bit more on what we do and a little bit more of our history. Um, we're excited, super excited about this because, again, it's uh, the roadmap to a stronger America. So we're doing like a Route 66 theme. You'll see like a car stable club and we're going all out. And each location um, is going to have. So um, as we mentioned, we have 15 locations throughout the Brazoria, Galveston and Southeast Harris County. Uh, but each location, you know, we started with one location at a time and you're going to see see a cone with a little flag and like a do we started first with our first location and you're going to see a number one um, and then the second location number two third location number three so each location is going to have their number of, of um, the order that they've been opened and I'm super excited for this um, I encourage all of our patients it, to write some type of feedback on our social media just to explain the gratitude and we just want to thank you thank you thank you so much for being a patient of ours and and really putting that trust in us because we appreciate it and that concludes our day four stay tuned for day five <music>